Hey y'all, it's Katie. Welcome back to Kate Miss. I am so excited to be doing another video for you guys today. Per usual, I just want to let you guys know there is a giveaway going on this month. We're doing 25 days of uploads up until Christmas, and then after that, baby is coming. Mama won't have time for doing any uploads. I will be taking a break. But in the meantime, throughout the whole month of December, I will be having a giveaway running on my YouTube channel. So I will have the video linked up here where you can find out all the information about how to enter the giveaway, what is being given away. There's a lot of awesome prizes. So I just just want to remind you that that is going on but today's video I want to try the 10 minute makeup challenge I don't want to be too confident but I feel like I should be able to do this fairly well but with that said I feel like it will still be a challenge because while I am someone who loves to go all out with my makeup I am okay going pretty simplistic but at the same time there are just certain steps to my makeup look that I always like to do like wing liner and that can be a little time consuming and I've never really timed myself while doing my makeup I feel like I could pretty comfortably do a 15 minute makeup look and have no problem so that's why I want to try a 10 minute and see if I can challenge myself a little bit and just to see if I can do a very simple makeup look and still get the look that I would want for the day. So that is what we are going to be doing today. I always love seeing other creators do this and I've never been able to do it myself. But for 25 days of daily uploads from Katie Marie over here, I wanted to do it since it's such a fun video and I've actually got some family coming over so I don't have time to do anything elaborate and get ready today. I won't have time to film. I figured this is a video I can most definitely get filmed. Just as a couple preliminary steps, I haven't pulled anything out to make it easier for myself. I just have my everyday makeup drawer over here. My brush is in front of me. I did cheat a little bit and I just turned on Paw Patrol for my kids. So hopefully there won't won't be any interruptions. I feel like that's a little bit of a cheat because <laughs> if I'm getting ready, there's going to be an interruptions. But since I only have 10 minutes, I was like, okay, I'm going to cut myself a little bit of a corner and just give them a little video to watch while I do this and get this makeup look done in 10 minutes. So I think that is all I wanted to say before jumping into it. I did do my skincare, but that is all I have on my face. So let's zoom in and start the timer. Okay, so I don't want to actually have you too zoomed in. I'm not going to be doing anything that exciting on my eyes and just in case I have to move around, I wanna make sure I'm in frame so I don't have to worry about the camera. But I have 10 minutes right here. Oh, I'm so nervous, <laughs> but let's just get going. Um, we're going to start. Okay, 10 minutes. I hope I have the volume up on my phone. I guess we will see. I'm taking this Kula SPF face moisturizer. The one thing I definitely do if I have to go light and I just need to get ready and out the door fast, is I will go light on my face. I feel like that's one thing that as long as I have a little bit of concealer, bronzer, and a highlight, I'm good to go. I don't need to do anything elaborate. I don't mind if I look very natural, no makeup on my face. Still gotta have my wings on, so that's what's something I have to kind of prep for and give myself enough time for. Okay, while that sets in, I'm gonna put on a little bit of concealer not too much since I am going so light with my makeup I don't want it to look super full coverage on my eyes I feel like I should be able to do this but at the same time knowing that I am timing myself I am nervous <laughs> and I feel like I need to hurry 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 but I'm just gonna go with the look that I typically would go for if I am short on time Okay, grabbing some concealer for my under eyes. Gonna dot that on. And I think, hmm, we'll just do a little bit here and here. I feel like I'm a little splotchy there. I'm not sure if I'm breaking out or, or what, but those two spots seem a little red recently. You have to let me know down below in the comments. I have no idea when this video is going to be going live. Got to make sure I'm still recording. Um, let me know down in the comments what you guys are thinking of Kate Miss. I just yesterday at the time of filming this figured out a name for it. I've been thinking about it for like the past two weeks and I couldn't think of anything. Katie Miss or Katie Marie Miss. I was ugh, couldn't think of anything I liked. But anyway, you have to let me know what you think how it's going, how you like it. This is actually the first video I am pre-filming for it, so it's kind of exciting for me, but like I said, I don't know when this is gonna be going live, so this could be the 24th video you've seen. I have no idea. I'm still planning out my schedule, but. Okay, just going in with some powder. I guess I haven't been telling you guys what I've been using. I'm just gonna take that same powder go all over my eyes 
my eyeshadow primer or concealer it's already starting to crease if I'm going super light on my eyeshadow primer is definitely one of those steps like eyeshadow primer it's definitely one of those steps I will skip and just do a concealer because I feel like I definitely always need to use a concealer because my eyes are so red and dark. Um, that was a Cover FX Perfect Setting Powder. Now I'm going to go in with my CoverGirl Healthy Vitalist Powder and I'm going to use that for my foundation. How are we doing? Let me make sure the volume is up on this. I have six minutes and... 42 seconds left. Okay, four minutes. I'm so bad at like guesstimating and stuff like that, so I feel like that should be enough, but at the same time, I'm like, I still have so much to do. What have I done? I really like this powder because I can just take this brush. It's from Real Techniques. It's like big and fluffy, but it's still kind of like dense, so it's nice for packing on powder, but not going too ham and heavy coverage. I know I am being so rough, but welcome to the world of <laughs> Katie. When I am in a hurry, I feel like I can be a little rough. And I'm going to have to slow down in a second for wing liner. Definitely a little scared. I forgot to prep that. I w that was another thing I was going to prep for and do uh, clean off my vamp stamp because I never clean it off. I usually just do it right before I need it. I'm going into this Laura Geller. What is this? Yes, the medium is their baked bronzer. I'm not planning to cut any of this out, so I'm sorry if it's a little boring. Maybe I'll put some music on when I'm just sitting here frantically doing my makeup, but uh, it's hard to like come up with conversations when I'm in a hurry. Oh, what do you think of that? This is the first video I'm putting this up for, well that I just finally hung up for Kate Miss for December. But like I said, this is my first video I'm filming, so it might change up a bit, but uh, I like it. I can put all my favorite little grungy knickknacks on it. Okay, now I'm gonna go into the Amrezy highlighter. And I feel like that's good for my face. Is it cheating to constantly be checking on yourself? Oh, where is it? Four more minutes. Why can't I find this? Ugh. So last thing I grab, ow, <laughs> this is the Maybelline liquid liner. Oh yes, I need my vamp stamp. I still wanna do my big old wings. Definitely hard to like think precisely and take my time and whatnot because I feel like my wings are definitely not going in the same direction today, but got less than four minutes. What else do I gotta do? Oh, I gotta do mascara. Mascara takes forever. I yeah, that got too big, but what you gonna do? Okay, whew, all right, sorry, so could not multitask there, but I can honestly never multitask when it comes to doing wing liner. Woo, I got some wings going on today. Going into the Thrive Cosmetics for my brows. I do like to always put something through them because I feel like all the powder definitely lightens them, so they look a little ashy. I think I got about two minutes left. I can do this. I just wish mascara is at one step. That, oh, it takes so long to get like, you know, I don't know, lashes that you kind of like. And that's just something I don't have time for. Okay, going into lips right now, I just need a moment before. I always like to have something, usually just a balm on my lips. This is the, uh, Lip oil from Butter London. Absolutely love that stuff. Great for days like today. And now, can I think? I'm just gonna go in with a brown from this Tarte palette. 
We're gonna go in with more of a cool tone brown. Tends to be my vibe. And I'm just popping that into my crease because definitely I feel like even when I go super light on my makeup, I like to have definition on my eyes. It just makes them not look so, I don't know, bare? Oh man, shoot. Went too close and too rough with my eye today. It is watering. Thank you so much, I. I appreciate that. Okay, okay, I need to do, I need to do some mascara and then if I have time I can pop in an inner corner highlight. I didn't put anything on my lower lash line. That's something that I usually do put a little, um, a little like very light eyeshadow down there. But I actually will some days not put any, ah, hook myself, any gel liner in my waterline. Just because if I'm going super light, I don't know. I just think it, it looks fine without it. One less step. Oh, I feel like it's gonna go off any second now, but I think I should have like a minute left. Oof. I do not like this mascara. minute left okay timer is done stop I have powder all over my phone <laughs> um all right let me clean up this inner corner because it looks a hot mess okay so that is technically my eye look my wings are definitely not going in the same direction not terrible but they're definitely a little uneven but what did I not get done um mascara to my liking this coverable one not a fan of it um don't hate me, but I'm going to go on with a different mascara and just try to give it a little bit of a plump while we talk. Um, yeah, I was in the middle of finishing my mascara. I'm definitely glad I saved that for last. I've been saving my mascara for last just because I do like that after like I'm completely done. I don't have to worry about any more powders getting stuck on my lashes than I do the lashes as a final step. Um, but yeah, I didn't get to do finish that and then I didn't get to kind of I would have liked to have done a touch more with my eyes. I would have liked to put an inner corner highlight and then finished up my lower lash line because I definitely feel like that just looks like I forgot about it and <laughs> that's not the fact. But besides that, I feel like I got everything done. So 10 minutes wasn't bad. Um, 15 minutes, I definitely could have taken a little more time and finished out and just done more to my eyes. But honestly, this is a look that I honestly go with a lot of days, especially on the weekends when my husband's home. We're planning on doing things or we just wanna spend time together with the kids and whatnot. I don't wanna sit here for an hour at my makeup table. So I'll do something really quick so we can get going and this is definitely a look I'd go for. But yeah, I think that is the video. Let me know what you guys think. Uh, I don't know, I don't think I failed it, but I definitely could have done a little bit more. Like I said, lower lash line and inner corner highlight are the two that I wish I just had a little bit more time. Um, the wings definitely got way bigger than I intended, but in a hurry, and yes, when I'm in a hurry and stressed, those tend to be the one thing that goes awry, but I just, I'm someone who always likes to have them. If I don't do wing liner, especially going so light on my makeup, if I don't do wing liner, I feel like I'm sick or something, like there's something wrong. But I was able to do my base, I like my base, and that's, you know, kind of important to me too, going out and about, is just to have a nice base, you know, some powder and whatnot to, to start the day, a little concealer, because that goes a long way. But yeah, let me know what you guys think of this video. I Like I said, it's a video I've always wanted to do. I've always wanted to challenge myself and see how quickly I could get ready. But it was always a video I just couldn't fit into, you know, do, uh, only uploading two or three times a week. So I'm super excited to have been able to do it for Kate Miss this year. Let me know your thoughts down below. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I really do appreciate you guys, and I will see you very soon in my next video tomorrow.